So hello and welcome to another little update on my micro layout which I've decided to call something like Cobbletown or Cobbleston, something like that I think. So um, got a little passenger train run around it for the moment. Uh, I've done a lot of bits on Instagram with the goods trains. If you don't follow us on Instagram take a look. Um, I tend to do uh, quite frequent posts in there. So a little bit of an update this week. What I've done is quite a bit of work in this area. Um, so I've got the roadway done and the paving slabs. Um, I've got another little building built in there. I can't remember if I showed you that in the last video. Anyway, little uh, one up, one down house that's going to sit in there. And I've started working on neatening up the tunnel mouth. And in fact, obviously the tunnel mouth's new as well. Uh, just um, Metcalf card and super quick edging on here. Uh, it is very close tolerance, but it looks quite nice. And it also shows quite well the idea of this layout being in the round or 360 degrees. Because what it means, when I'm watching trains round, I've got lots of different scenes. I've got the tunnel mouth scene there, backs of houses, industrial area, under the bridge, across the level crossing, through the station, and then through the cutting, underneath the little footbridge and out. So there's something like six scenes there on a three foot by 20 inch board. And you can do exactly the same, in fact, on an, any layout. The idea is to put enough scenes in. It's very nice having a six foot long grass cutting for your train to run along, but it is really just one scene. And the idea of this is to put more scenes in. Um, one of the reasons I haven't got a lot of building done is I have been actually running locos quite a lot. I've got such a nice little choice of uh, 040s. Um, that I've been able to, to enjoy running them round. That black one is quite nice. I am toying with just tarting and lifting it a little bit by painting in the gold handrails and that sort of thing. So we might have a little look at that. But it is a lovely little runner. Goes around very nicely. So there we go, only a little update. Um, not a great deal done, although it's quite time consuming doing some of this, so it's a bit more than it looks. Um, and I hope you're still enjoying the layout. I hope you're still enjoying your model railways in these difficult times and we will continue to post videos. We had fun in the week with the live stream. Sorry if you missed that, but we, we had some of the highest viewing figures we've ever had for a view, uh, live stream. So we'll probably do another one. And we're also planning lots of new uh, 3D printed models. So that again is taking time at the moment. Um, we've got a double controller box planned, um, an 009 engine shed, uh, possibly an 009 station, some brake vans in 009, that sort of thing. Um, so look out for those in the next few months, they'll be on the website. So I've just finished now with a few shots of my lovely little British Railways 040 going through the town scene. And uh, we'll speak to you again soon. Hi, thanks for watching the video and for the nice comments. Uh, click on the left for a previous video in this series. Click on the right for another video you might enjoy. And please don't forget to click to subscribe, like, comment, etc. Thanks again.